So uh, one of the things that is distinct about this project is the, the support both from the private sector and foundations and also um, importantly from our federal government and the public sector. Um, and right from the start, somebody who has, I think, seen eye to eye in particular in conversations uh, with Bob and with his teammate Eva Caldera in the front row, uh, Chairman Jim Leach um, of the National uh, Endowment for Humanities uh, made one of the first gifts in a uh, chairman's grant last year to support technical meeting we had in uh, Washington, D.C. Um, he was there at the National Archives and made the case for this project in the nation's capital and most recently made a $1 million award, um, an unusual, out of cycle, completely amazing uh, support to kick off the Digital Hubs pilot project that we will be talking about in a moment. Uh, Chairman Leach. Well, thank you, uh, John. Uh, uh, the importance of a digital public library uh, is self-evident. Uh, there have been prior revolutions in the democratization of ideas. We had the development of marks and combinations of letters to represent words. We've had the invention of paper, the printing press, the establishment of schools, especially public schools, libraries, universities. And they've all been seminal stages in knowledge development and dissemination. Uh, the concept of establishing in the public domain an easily accessible repository of a vast conglomeration of written material and created matter is a logical extension of these prior revolutions. Uh, the reason the National Endowment for the Humanities has made our largest grant in recent years uh, to this undertaking is to accelerate the corporate organizing to reduce the uncertainties and reward with legitimizing support the efforts that have been launched uh, by so many of you in this room. Uh, as an observer, it would seem that the key is to blast full steam forward and ensure coordination not only with all other libraries and museums, but all their efforts underway from the Library of Congress to the Hathi Trust, from Europeana to Google. And I remain hopeful that it, at some point the United States Congress will give meaningful priority to this enterprise, but in the immediate future, it would seem that private foundations are gonna to have to carry uh, the major burden. Uh, in the meantime, I'd like simply to express my re uh, respect uh, to all those committed to one of the great revolutions of our age. Uh, this is a true and worthy uh, pioneering effort. Thank you. Chairman Leach, thank you, and I, in echoing your words, I think the importance of the, uh, this award from uh, the NEH is not just the million dollars, which is extremely useful, but really is the legitimizing force of this, um, of this award, and on the day that you announced it, it was a big, splashy thing on the website of the NEH, and we all noticed, so thank you, thank you for that, uh, and all else.